Hello everyone, Pixel Monk here, and welcome to an old school RuneScape guide showing you how to complete the quest, Ernest the Chicken. This quest is considered novice difficulty and is short length, about 10 minutes long. The requirements for this quest include the ability to defeat or run away from a level 22 skeleton. The required items for this quest include Spade, which can be obtained during the quest. Although not required, it is highly recommended that you also have an Amulet of Glory. There are some maps in the description below that help you to identify some of the key points of this quest. Open it up to keep it handy. You start the quest by talking to Veronica, who is standing just outside of the Drainer Manor gates. The easiest way to get there is by using an Amulet of Glory to Drainer Village and then walking north, or just simply walk from Lumbridge or Falador. Once there, talk to Veronica. When prompted, say, Aha! Sounds like a quest. I'll help. Walk north along the path until you come to Drainer Manor. Enter the large doors. Once inside, enter the next door to your north and climb up the stairs to the second floor. Then, use the spiral staircase nearby to reach the third floor and talk to Professor Odenstein, who is in the room to the east. When prompted, say, I'm looking for a guy called Ernest, and change him back this instant. The professor will tell you that Ernest has changed into a chicken, and needs parts that were stolen from him to change Ernest back. For the first item, go back down the spiral staircase. Just to the south of the staircase will be a blue box containing fish food. You must walk into the eastern hallway and then south to get into this room. Pick up the fish food. Next, go back down to the ground floor. Enter a small room that is just to the northwest of you. You must enter the kitchen to get here. Pick up the poison, which looks like a green bottle. Once you have both items, use the fish food on the poison to create poisoned fish food. Now you must exit the manor, however you cannot use the front door, so you must walk to the most eastern room of the manor. Before you use the door to go outside, you can pick up the spade that is in this room if you don't already have one. Exit and walk all the way around the manor until you come across a fountain. This is just southwest of the building. Once there, use your poisoned fish food on the fountain to kill the piranhas. After a few seconds, search the fountain to find a pressure gauge. Walk back slightly north past the leprechaun until you come across a compost heap. Search the heap to receive a key. You must now enter the manor again, so use the front door nearby and enter the main room with the staircase. Just behind the staircase to the north is a very small room with a level 22 skeleton inside. You must collect the rubber tube that is on the ground. However, it is up to you if you want to either fight this skeleton or avoid it. Open the door and make sure you get the rubber tube. Once you have that, walk to the most western room of the manor and search the bookcase to get access to the secret room. When you are inside the room, climb down the ladder. Now you must solve a puzzle. If you haven't already, I highly suggest that you open up the map that is in the description to help with this next part. In this puzzle, you'll be pulling levers in order to open a certain door. There are 12 steps in total, but if you mess up at any time, you may go back up the ladder to reset. Step 1. Pull levers A and B down. Step 2. Enter door 1. Step 3. Pull lever D down. Step 4. Enter doors 2 and 3. Step 5. Pull levers A and B up. Step 6. Enter doors 3, 
four, and five. Step seven, pull levers E and F down. Step eight, enter doors six and seven. Step nine, pull lever C down. Step 10, enter doors seven and six. Step 11, pull lever E up. Step 12, enter doors six, eight, three, and nine. When you are through door nine, pick up the oil can and go back up the ladder. Use the lever on the eastern side to get out of the secret room. With the pressure gauge, rubber tubing, and oil can, you must go back to Professor Odenstein on the top floor to complete the quest. Congratulations, you have received four quest points and 300 coins. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this guide and found it helpful. If you did, please subscribe for more, and I'll see you next time.